Ellis is not related to Lou Gehrig, but his in-laws were friends with the Gehrigs. My mother-in-law asked me, what would you like, Bob, what would you like as a Father's Day gift? And I said, well, I'd certainly like the hat. This Yankees hat, once owned and worn by Lou Gehrig, is the prized item of a new auction of authentic Gehrig memorabilia, 72 pieces in all, from baseballs. And here's Lou Gehrig right on what they call the sweet spot. To personal pictures, including his baby picture, all the way to the Iron Horse's actual car registration. It's a one-of-a-kind document. It's written in Henry Louis Gehrig. I think anything that's got that signature becomes very valuable. There are few Yankees more beloved than Lou Gehrig. Today, I consider myself the luckiest man on the face of the earth. His 1939 speech came just weeks after he was diagnosed with an incurable disease. It'd be wonderful if, if it went to people who are, have as much interest in the history of Lou Gehrig as I've come to have. The pieces are with Heritage Auction House in Dallas. The game use items like the hat are valued at $200,000. Other items like pictures range from $100 to $4,000, but just as coveted. Those top tier athletes, Babe Ruth, Lou Gehrig, Ty Cobb, you know, all aspects of their, of their life are sought after by collectors. Most of the items have spent decades in a safe. Little did Bob know the value of these pieces. This collection is expected to fetch nearly half a million dollars. The benefactors of all this stuff is going to be, is going to be my two children and my three grandchildren. Wonderful. Grandparents helping their grandkids' education. But there's a catch. All five of them are Red Sox fans. So the pride of his life will benefit from the pride of the Yankees. In Woodbridge, Connecticut, Steve Overmeyer, CBS 2 News.